What I love about real estate wholesaling is that it gives me a lot of freedom. You know, not only have I developed my business to the place where I don't have to clock in at a job, but it gives me the ability to do things and to have fun and to go out and, and to see the world and enjoy nature like I, I like to do. I enjoy being outside and enjoying what God made and I enjoy being with my family and experiencing all the good times that I used to just dream about and, and now I'm getting to experience some of these things and it's really wonderful and I want you to share in those with me. This is going to change your life. It's just like following the recipe on the back of a cake box. You know, we've all done that, probably gone to the store and bought that cake mix box and we brought it home. And, and even if you've made a cake a hundred times, you still need to reference that recipe on the back of the box and follow the instructions. And if you follow the instructions and you block out all of the other ideas that might come along, you know, of, hey, maybe I should put this in or maybe I could do this or maybe I could do that. If you just get rid of all of that stuff and get focused, you know, I think a lot of people are just bombarded with a lot of information from YouTube University and gurus and courses and things that they've done and things that, and, and all of that's great information but the process is very very simple to real estate wholesaling so it's just like a recipe you follow it step by step by step and it works every single time and we have students that are actually accomplishing this and they're, they're going step by step they're, they've invested the focus they've invested the time and the energy which is usually about two hours a day, five days a week, just to be honest. If you can't put a little bit of time into your business, then, then your business is not gonna grow, right? If you can't put a little bit of your energy and, 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 and put momentum behind your business, it's, it's just not gonna go anywhere. But if you can put the focus in and you can follow that recipe, you can have yourself a great real estate wholesaling business and there's students out there doing it. So I know that if you can do that, then you can also have the same results. Of course, I'm like a lot of people, and I haven't always been a real estate wholesaler. Not not full time, of course. Uh, I've done a lot of things in my life. I've probably had a thousand different jobs. I've I've probably been fired from a thousand different jobs. You know, I I'm probably one of those people you would consider unemployable. I just never wanted to work a job. I, I never wanted to ask a boss if it was okay for me to go see family or take my family on a trip or, you know, do do anything. I, I, I just don't like, I, I don't like the feeling of just kind of being a slave. And so, you know, I've tried a lot of things. But, you know, real estate wholesaling has always won my heart. and It's always kept me coming back for more. <laughs> And because it works and because it gives me that opportunity to kind of get away from the job, the, the just over broke scenario that most of us are, are stuck in. And so, you know, basically, I, I've done some pretty incredible things because of real estate wholesaling. I've been offered opportunities to work as an investment banker. I've, I've even pitched deals at the, the top penthouse floor of the, the Fox Studios building in Los Angeles, California. And I've done multiple million dollar transactions, not million dollar, but multiple millions of dollars, like 10 and 20 million dollar transactions. And where did I learn how to do all that? Well, I learned how to do that being a real estate wholesaler. So exactly, you know, it, it's won my heart. And I've basically always come back to real estate wholesaling. It doesn't matter what I'm involved in or what opportunities open up. You better bet Justin's always wholesaling a, a piece of real estate somewhere, somehow. And I want to show you exactly how I do it. It's super simple. I have since cut out pretty much everything in my life other than real estate wholesaling. And that's exactly what I do now full time, all the time, and have for many years. And I want to show you exactly how you can do the same thing. Shut up. But believe me, I've been young and dumb, and I have made many mistakes. I, I've, I've also owned an insurance brokerage at one time, and it was pretty successful, guys, and, and I squandered it all away. I partied, and I, I threw it all away. I was a bit of a prodigal son, if you know what that reference means. 
And so, you know, I've, I've really had to develop myself and my character and to grow and to produce what I have today has been a long journey. And I, I, what I have today is, is a, an, a real estate wholesaler business that's pretty much almost 100% outsourced where I don't have to do all those routine mundane tasks every single day to get property deals under contract and to sell them off, whether that's ugly houses or whether that's pretty houses or wholesaling lease options. I've got it just about outsourced where now I get to enjoy my life. I get to have fun and, and embrace my family and enjoy all the things that I used to just lay there in agony dreading tomorrow's job. And I used to dream, man, wouldn't it be so nice if I could just do something with my family tomorrow if I could just do something that I want to do instead of going and building somebody else's dream you know and so yeah I, I totally understand where most of you are coming from and I have developed a process in, in my own life and I want to share that process with you because I'm confident 100% that this process is going to really really help move you into the places that you want to go now it's not a quick overnight thing guys this is work if you want to build a business, you're going to have to work. You're going to have to put some time and effort, and you're going to have to learn and develop you, you know, get you on track to being that. As soon as you become those things, you'll have those things in your life. In other words, what I'm saying, who do you have to become to get the things that you want? That's what the question I was asking myself when I was just broke and busted, having lost all of my business, all of my money, all of my friends, and, and I had family even turning my back on me in, in some cases. And I was in, I was just in a deep, deep depression and I just prayed to God and I said, God, who is it that I have to become to get some of these things that I want so badly in my life? And God really has kind of drawn me through a process and I know that he can do the same thing for you. If you want that, you can go through your life and, and slowly, but surely, and it's not even all that slow really, but it's not a quick automatic today kind of thing. But with a coach that, that has, understands this, I, I can help move you through, you know, the step by step by step to get you out of this kind of broke ass scenario of never getting ahead and always building somebody else's dream. That stuff is just, it's death and I hate it. And I don't want to see anybody trapped there because that is just a horrendous feeling right down here, right down here in your gut. I, you hate it when, when it just eats you up down there that you got to go do something and build somebody else's dream and build somebody else's wealth and build somebody else's cash and, and, and pay for their vacations and pay for their family to have a great time all while your family suffers and does without many times the most basic necessities. I know what that feels like. And those days, they, are, they have come to an end for me. And they can come to an end for you. There is hope. So let's talk about you for a minute. Where are you today? What is that feeling that you have down in your gut today? Where are you being led in your life, in your path, in your journey? Have you grown tired? Have you grown frustrated? Have you grown depressed? always building someone else's dream, always studying and learning about real estate wholesaling, but never being able to get over the, the first hurdle to getting your first deal? Do you have all of this passion and you just don't know where to direct it? Do you want to make a change? Do you really want to make a change? Do you really want to become the person that you need to become to have the things that you want? I'm not a flashy guy. I'm, in fact, I'm, I'm kind of a hillbilly. I grew up in the hills of Kentucky. And I, I really didn't know a whole lot of the outside world for much of my life. My mom and dad are ministers. And in many ways, I felt very, very sheltered in life. But I had this unrest deep inside me. Do you have that? Do you have that unrest inside you? Is there something calling you to greatness? Is there something calling you from where you are in that routine, mundane rut, which is just a grave with both, both ends kicked out? That's what a rut is. Are you stuck in a rut? And are you willing to do whatever it takes? Are you willing to change who you are to become something bigger and better? I'm not a flashy guy. I'm not here to show you mansions and hot rods and helicopters and airplanes. Oh, I've traveled. I've been in almost every state. 
I've done all kinds of wonderful things. I've seen all kinds of things in this world and there's many, many, many more things that I wanna go see. There's many things that I wanna go do. It's not for lack of wanting things. We all want things. But there are some people who are not willing to do what it takes to get those things. I hope that's not you. And I believe because you're watching this right now, you're looking into this, you're studying this, that this is actually who you want to be. You want to be someone bigger, someone better, someone stronger. And I want you to know it is possible. If I can do it, you can do it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Can we do this together? The answer is yes. We can do this together. I know we can. And I believe in you. I know you can do this. Hey, baby. <laughs> Are you ready? Um, uh, yeah. Let's go.